What does the 95th percentile mean? Have you ever wondered what it means when someone mentions the 95th percentile? This term is often used in statistics, especially when analyzing data. Let's break it down in a straightforward way. The 95th percentile is a measure that tells us the value below which 95% of the data points in a data set fall. This means that if you have a collection of numbers, the 95th percentile is the point where only 5% of the numbers are higher. To understand this better, imagine you have a list of test scores from a class. If the 95th percentile score is 85, that means 95% of the students scored 85 or lower. Only 5% scored higher than that. This is particularly useful when looking at performance data, resource usage, or even traffic patterns. It helps us focus on the typical behavior while reducing the impact of extreme values. Now, how do we calculate the 95th percentile? First, we need to sort the data from the smallest to the largest. Next, we find the position of the 95th percentile using a simple formula. If you have a total of n values, you multiply n by 0 0.95. If the result is not a whole number, you round it up to the nearest whole number. This gives you the position in the sorted list. If it is a whole number, you average the values at that position and the next one. The value you find at this position is your 95th percentile. This measure has practical applications in various fields. For instance, in network monitoring, the 95th percentile helps companies avoid charging four brief spikes in traffic. Instead, it focuses on sustained high usage, which is more indicative of overall performance. In Performance Benchmark, it helps identify typical peak loads while filtering out temporary spikes that might skew the data. When comparing the 95th percentile to other statistical measures, it stands out. The average can be influenced by extreme values, while the median represents the middle point and does not reflected high-end data. The maximum value simply shows the highest point, which may not representing typical conditions. Understanding the 95th percentile is important for effective measurement. It provides a balanced view of upper bound behavior without overemphasizing rare spikes. This is especially useful in planning for capacity, where systems need to accommodate most usage scenarios. For example, a cloud service might use this metric to allocate bandwidth efficiently, ensuring reliability for 95% of user demand. Additionally, the concept of percentiles can help assess data spread. The difference between two percentiles can give you a sense of how data is distributed. The top 5% represents values above the 95th percentile, often requiring separate analysis. By focusing on the 95th percentile, analysts can prioritize actionable trends over anomalies. This makes it a key component in descriptive statistics, especially in measurement-driven fields. Understanding this concept can help you make better decisions based on data.